All right, gentlemen, we went over the rules in the dressing room. I expect a good, clean fight. Obey my commands at all times. Remember, guys, I'm fair, but I'm firm. Touch them up. Pacquiao's co-manager is named Martin Elordi. Elordi is the son of Flash Elordi, the most revered figure in Filipino boxing. If Pacquiao is anywhere near as good as Elordi, we've got a real fight coming up. Pacquiao, Pacquiao, say Pacquiao. Pacquiao. Say Pacquiao. 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 Yeah. Pacquiao should fight here. He shouldn't try to get into a boxing match with this master boxer from South Africa. You got to fight this guy because he knows how to slip, punch. Whole book, he has it. Freddie Roach said to me yesterday, hey, look, we have great respect for Lidwaba, and we know he's a great boxer, but he won't be able to handle Manny's firepower. Well, he took a beating in that round. By CompuBox numbers, round one was huge for Pacquiao. He landed 32 out of 82, including 22 out of 40 power shots against Ledwaba's 9 of 28. So we watched Ledwaba get off to a great start down in South Africa. Here he gets off to an uncertain start against Pacquiao's hard punches in round one. And here comes the Filipino fighter again. Boom! Ledwaba is going to have to do something to slow down his charge because otherwise he's not going to be able to handle his aggression as a boxer. He's got to fight. Yep. You've got, you've got, this far away from home, can't depend on your boxing skills all the time. You got to fight. You want to fight? The fight is yours, but it's not going to develop like that. Oh, you talk about getting old in a hurry. Lichinola Ledwaba looks like an old 29 in there Six, against 24 year old Manny seven, Pacquiao right now. Eight. How you feel? You okay? I didn't see the punch. It, it looked like a short left hand. We'll have to see in the replay. I think it was a bunch of punches. I think it was the whole fuselage. I think it started in the first couple of punches thrown in the first round. Absolutely. I think this guy just hit so hard that Lenwaba is totally on the defensive. Lenwaba came in as a potential star. Right now, it looks like Pacquiao may go out as the star. He took this fight on only two weeks' notice, only came here to America ten days ago, and he is banging Ledwaba right now. You gotta fight. If you want to be a star, you gotta fight. That's a rude awakening for a good master boxer like Ledwaba. There you go. A body shot by Ledwaba. That may change the odds. You got it. lands two straight lefts. He went to the body, and that's the most important shot tonight. Right to the body. So Ledwaba momentarily coming alive after having tasted canvas in round two, having tasted his own blood in round one. This is the time to go to the body if you're Ledwaba. Go to the body and beat and main town pain. And he has suddenly stopped Pacquiao's assault. Now Pacquiao okay. comes back with a body shot of his own. And bangs Ledwaba again with a big left upstairs. What a fight. They're trading vicious body shots at short range. Ledwaba has not landed that left hook once he throws that. If he's able to throw it, you can see a different fight, a left hook to the body. Well, he's going to get a chance, too, because Pacquiao is squaring up. Oh, fire. Sequence after sequence. Let's see what caused the knockdown directly. All right, seconds out. Oh, yeah, that little left. A little straight left hand that was seconds so out. short that you could hardly corner, see guys. it. Trainer Norman Babani pleading with him as he got up out of his corner between rounds. Throw the left hook, land the left hook. Hock out of the body with an explosive shot. And another. And a big right hand upstairs. And now he's got Ledwaba back on the defensive and bleeding badly. He's got to stay on it. He cannot give him a break. Guy from the Philippines. Guy from South Africa. Giving us a hell of a fight. And Pacquiao wobbled Ledwaba again. 
with a hard punch at the end of the round. Right, breathe, 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 breathe. Deep breath, Manny. All right, here you go, sir. Stay right here. Okay, Manny. Right, Manny. Oh, Manny. Oh, Manny. Listen to me. Stay right here. Okay, you gotta start following this man. You gotta step out, cut the ring off for me, okay? Okay. Okay, don't follow him, not here. Okay. I want more head movement, okay? Don't stand right in front of this man. Manny, look at me. Little head movement, okay? Okay. All right? Just like your face. Right. Leo, 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 Leo. Okay, okay. okay. Hmm. you know better than that, right? Yeah. Be smart. You hear me? Five rounds in the Good head oh. movement. Okay, let's right, keep it going. Go. Oh. Free, free. The veteran trainer go. speaking to Galog. In Manny Pacquiao's corner is Ben Delgado, who's been his trainer throughout his professional career. Del Delgado now gracefully stepping back to number two to allow Freddie Roach to take over because they think Roach can take him to another level. There are so many southpaw cuties in the lower weight classes. There aren't that many southpaw punters with mustard. Pacquiao is fun to watch. Boom! He's been caught by surprise. He's a good fighter. He had no idea. Pacquiao may take care of it. Four, four, five, six, seven, eight. How you feel? You gonna continue? When have you ever seen a fighter say, I'm, I'm not okay? There's a weariness and almost a resignation in the eyes of Red Waba. Yeah, and Joe Cortez has seen enough. That's a TKO victory for the very impressive Manny Pacquiao, who takes a good fighter and just takes him apart with power yeah, shots. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. That's what I wanted. Yeah. yeah. Pacquiao wanted. took the fight on two weeks' notice. Ledwaba thought he was going to be fighting against a fighter named Enrique Sanchez. As George said, he got surprised here. Uh, I think Pacquiao established himself as a crowd-pleasing entry into the featherweight division tonight. I had never seen him. I frankly had never heard of him. But I've seen and heard of him now. And you want to see him again. I want to see him again. <laughs> I do too. <laughs> After we saw Ledwaba in South Africa, we said to ourselves, well, let's see him again. He looked really good. Now let's see Pacquiao again. That was some performance. So a world title belt for Manny Pacquiao as he lifts it away from Lesanola Ledwaba. There's the first knockdown, straight left hand. It's a quarter to five in the morning in Soweto, where, where Ledwaba is from. There is no joy in Soweto Sunday morning. And here's the second knockdown. And uh, as Larry, as you said at the beginning of the round, there was a weariness about Ledwaba. He it began the round. This. The guy was out. <laughs> <laughs> he went to his corner the previous round out. Yeah, you, you pointed, pointed that out. out to you. Yeah, that he, wasn't was, it. he was walking on well, little shuffle That was feet. nothing in his eyes but sleep. Yep. Well, and a certain resignation that it wasn't going to get any better. Yep. Oh, mm -hmm. when you go to your corner and you can't see, you don't have any resignation. Oh, you are resigned. <laughs> Period. Night. Night lights out. Yep. Well, I would have kept him down. Corners in seen, the corner yeah. after round five because of the way he walked back yeah. there. Because he took a huge shot at the end of the fifth round. He didn't know where he was. No, I don't think he could do that with a with a terrific champion. You hope that he can pull himself together and you pay respect to him if he wants to go on. Because what, he what happens on, he after this? He didn't, want, he didn't know where he was to want to go. On. Hey, let's go up to ring announcer Michael Buffer and pay honor to Manny Pacquiao. Ladies and gentlemen, at 59 seconds of round number six. Referee Joe Cortez, following the second knockdown, waves off the count and calls a halt to the bout. The winner by knockout victory, and now a two-time world champion. He is now the reigning IBF Super Bantamweight Champion of the World, Manny Pacquiao. You know, I said before this fight, guys, that if he was anywhere near as good as Flesh Alorty, we would really see something.